Greetings. Hey, it's Susie Key. We're working with uh, something happened, the Akashic Records come through, and then there you have it, the automatic writing piece. I've been doing this for 15 years, and I absolutely, absolutely love it, and I'm always curious about what's coming up next with these words. So right now we're going to start off with this automatic written piece, and we're going to start now. A ship in the sea, you and I, harbor the light. Waves upon waves, unraveling personality structures, there too is the light. The helm of your knowing seeks to overcome the energies about. There too is the light, where the breach widens and the personality structures faces disharmony within. Spaces of openings or cracks in the integrity you and I Semblances of faint embedded light reveal. A closer peek at the peak of breach reintroduces the light to the spaces that now are exposed. Openings within are well versed in receiving this light. Microscopic tendencies, reminders of crystalline grids that recalibrate and restore these wounds caused by tumultuous energies about. So small, the idea of wounds carried for eons of three, and yet here you are at the helm of being free. Loosening the reins ever so slightly to start widens the bandwidth of your auric nature to light. Your journeys of your lifetimes, too many to count, now are attainable to clear the debris. This question, my dear ones, are you ready to let go? Can you see this incarnation with a new declaration of liberation? Breathing in deeply for a count of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, let it go. Breathing out deeply for a count of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, boom, let it go. Let it go. Let it all go. It's safe to let it all go. Breaches in life come and go, and there you are saturated in the light. Allowances of wounds of your own knowing heal through the light. Allowances of wounds of your knowing heal through the light. Let it go. Let it all go. It's safe to let it all go. Frequencies of light pour through and into your soul essence and filter into all of your Akashic realms. This wide sweep touches the cosmological flow. When one incarnate soul touches the light, the all of all smiles, you and I. Time, the eternal now, illustrates the smile, the laughter, the joy, the elation, the connection, and our universal love. Set point locked in. <laughs> All right. So there we go. Wow. So a lot of these energies are so prime and so ready to get this beautiful band of energies called, called people, right? Or beings or divine beings or um, just soul journey beings, whatever it is, is that we're always working with what we call this sense of light, this sense of feeling lighter in the body, the sense of just, you know, really like ex expressing out your beautiful light, bringing the light back in and then letting it flow out with those in breaths that, that was nine in breaths. And then there were 12 uh, uh, out uh, exhalations that go through. So the more that we can kind of like kind of get more saturated in this beautiful light and noticing with our breath breathing in and breathing out breathing in and breathing out Whew. prana that life force energy is all about that beautiful light that beautiful consciousness that we're working with it that we're resting in. that's who we are it's exactly who we are so this beautiful essence this beautiful uh, automatic written piece was uh, something that came through and a lot of times I've got 15 years of this and every once in a while I pick something and it was like well 
I think I can, I think that I can put, I can do this and I can recite it and I can bring more life into it, bring more life and more light into this energy. So the more that we focus on what we do want, what we do want, some of that was about disharmony, but when we think about what we do want, we start focusing on that, which we want to do or which we want to experience or what or that flow that comes in, just feeling that beautiful vibrational attunement with this beautiful energy of this beautiful beautiful light. Whew. <laughs> so the Akashic Records uh, took me a while to figure out, but most of my automatic writing pieces are related to my own personal Akashic Records. You could say the Book of Soul, the Book of, uh, the Book of Life, the Akashic Records. There's probably many, many other ways that we can look at it where we can access um, other experiences from our soul's expression. And the more that we do that, the more the soul starts just kind of coming in. It just keeps coming in and giving us more information, more um, ideas of how we can heal the body, how we can uh, have better relationships, have more abundance in our field, and then really working with that sense of love of self, that sense of love of self, really working with that sense of love of self. So I think that's it for now. It's been super fun, super groovy. We'll see you soon and namaste.